Today we want to discuss about a fine up circuit knock and battery connection system because a lot of people have confusion on it and how to make sure the battery and wire and connects works. First of all, we want to talk about the G size. The G size is the only cost stack wire coil system and the finer, the AE and all the rest of the crossbow regular bow is going our, our traditional easy coil and clip and lock system, which is right here. Let's focus on the G-Nut to start with. Unlike other finer, G-Nut battery, as you can see, is called a stack coil. That means you just simply make sure you've got an O-ring on it, you push it in and you push it in like this. That's the end of it. You do not twist it. Because when you twist it clockwise, you can cause the wire to bind. From this point, you can see if it binds, it will touch the middle of the pin part. It will short it. You can anti-clockwise turn it all day long. It doesn't hurt it. But you clockwise it, you're going to cause it to have problems. That means if you ever tune the fire nut when it was inside, it's always advised to counterclockwise tune the nut, not clockwise. Because when you clockwise, sometimes these two bind, you cause this to clockwise turn, and this can bind. Now you look at that fine nut G size, the circuit board is sitting, the LED is nothing more than the nut sitting on it. So the whole thing is controlled by the end cap. That's it. That's a fine nut G. While fine nut AE and all the rest of it is called the clip and lock system, which we patented back in 2006. Which you see, there were two slots right here. It needs side. It actually go into the circuit board and click. See that? The circuit board become part of the deal that's become a portal connection between the nut and the body. And the second part is how you put the battery in. Yes, there's a battery O-ring. No matter what, make sure you got it there. You insert it with a battery in counterclockwise. And you remove it with counterclockwise. Because when you clockwise it, it is very high chance this battery will bind. See that? It will cause it to twist. And actually, in most cases, it will tear this off the circuit board. So you always, now when you do this, you don't counterclockwise tune it, you counterclockwise. Because when you clockwise it, instead of anything on the bind, you cause the wire to break. See how it turns right here? It binds. So you always want to counterclockwise when you turn the circuit board. Finally, same thing with the fine nut normal and crossbow side. You see that two hole? That's our pattern clip and lock system. You slide the circuit board in it and you click it. And you put using the pin o-ring on the battery. Again, you counterclockwise push it in. Now, since I'm doing this, I want to show you. See, this is a green LED on the red knock. <laughs> it's not good at all. If you want to, you should put it on a green LED on a green knock. See how nice it looks? Well, that concluded our final battery, wire, and knock connection system. Bye.